Hi, I'm Santosh Joshi and I'm your life transformation coach. Today I'm going to tell you a story which is a heart touching story but a story of hope. A little boy came from school on Saturday and told his father, my teacher has given us homework to hug 10 people and tell them, keep faith, be patient and I love you. The dad said, okay, we'll go to the mall tomorrow morning and do it. So next morning, boy wake up all spirited, got ready, went to his dad and said, let's go. The father said, there is heavy rainfall. I feel nobody might be there. Boy still insisted. So the father drove in the horrible rain to the mall. They stood in the mall for about an hour and the boy hugged nine people. His father then said, now let's go. It's raining heavily and we shouldn't get stuck in the traffic. Sad, the boy went along with his father's orders. As they were driving past, the child pointed at a random house and said, please dad, just one person is remaining. I'll go to that house and complete my homework. The father smiled, pulled the car over. The child went to the door and began to ring the bell and pound the door strongly. He kept waiting. Finally, the door was slowly opened. A lady came out with a very sad look and gently asked, what can I do for you, son? With radiant eyes and a bright smile, the boy said, ma'am, my teacher has told us to hug 10 people and tell them, keep faith, be patient and I love you. I have hugged nine. May I hug you and pass the message to you? The lady embraced him and started crying profusely. On seeing that, the boy's father came out of the car. He went to the lady and asked, any problem, ma'am? She composed herself, took them inside, gave them a cup of tea and said, my husband died a while ago, leaving me totally alone in this world. Today morning, the loneliness took over me. Since morning, I have been thinking that this is the end of the road for me. Then I took a chair, a rope to my bedroom and decided to end my life. As I was seeing the world for the one last time, I begged for forgiveness and then heard this knock. I thought to leave it, but then nobody comes to visit me. So when I opened the door, I couldn't believe what my eyes saw, this little child. And when he said, keep faith, be patient and I love you, I knew this was the message from the universe. Suddenly I realized I don't want to die anymore and I have decided to make something productive from my life. So there's, there's a couple of lessons in this story. Lesson number one, never lose hope. In the worst of your times, you're always being guided and protected by the universe. Lesson number two, how many times have you given hope to someone who has lost hope? Or positive thoughts to people? Or told them you stand by them? Or just listen to them? You could be the medium that saves life.